Tonight, a Southeast Texas film production team is finishing a short film about the 1943 Beaumont race riot. Their goal? To shed light on part of Beaumont's history and start a conversation about race relations today. Fox 4 Sarita Mean reports what it took to get this film off the ground. Ready and action! Actors and production crew members take their posts on this set in orange to tell a story. This actually started 10 to 12 years ago, Wyatt and I were doing research for a documentary about the 1943 Beaumont race riot. A part of Beaumont history that Gordon Williams wanted to share with audiences through the fictional story of two men in a short film called The Example. It's about two fathers and the decisions that they make on a night at a roadblock that affects their family and their legacy, their manhood, and they even question themselves on what is the right thing to do. Not an easy thing to do, especially when on a budget. We have people from the community that have been here for three days strong, volunteering their time overnights. You know, it's people that have been dedicated to this project, to the story. My family's from Orange, going back six generations. A Lamar University grad, Kate Robards, is excited about sharing history from her hometown. Being able to portray a character who essentially could have been one of my ancestors is really, really cool. Portraying a character she thinks can help open a dialogue about race relations in the southeast Texas area. And each generation has a, a hopefully unifying experience, and that's what the story does. It reminds us that we are all people at the end of the day, and it's about being an example and being a good neighbor. It's rare to get this kind of experience in Southeast Texas on a professional film set, so this is a valuable learning experience. A learning experience for the crew and a look back in time, Williams hopes will help viewers today. In Orange, Sarai Demean, Fox 4 News. The short film will be entered in various competitions and film festivals later this year.